Alrighty, my people. I'm a little disappointed that not as many of you guys that watch most of my videos where I speak to you um, didn't end up uh, joining in on my live streams about how to make guaranteed money every single day. And the only thing that's guaranteed is you don't lose money. Like you might not make a lot some days, but you never lose money. And so, I'm probably going to go through the video, take some screenshots. Um, there's some things I want to show you. Basically, when the, so I'm trading the QQQ calls and puts, right? And so if you thought about today's market, I don't know how many of you guys were watching the market, but like it opened at 0.5%, dropped to 0.2% pretty quickly. And then after maybe an hour, it ran all the way to 1%. And then it ran all the way to negative 1% by close of the day. I can show you screenshots of my portfolio throughout the entire time. And like, I might temporarily drop a couple, like a couple percent of my account balance. But as the ticker moves, I'm always collecting profits all day long. And when it takes the big moves, so it's either not going to take a big move and I'm going to take a lot of, I'm going to collect a lot of profits. Um, I'm probably going to do 50 trades in a day. Like today was only 13 trades for $3,000 and I never had more than $30,000 invested in the market. So I made 10% on my investment and it was all one day and you can't lose money, like I said, because when it keeps running one direction, the amount that you have in the call option makes more than the amount that you're losing in the pop put options. Um, and if it doesn't run very far either direction in the day, then it's going back and forth all day. And that's when I'm collecting profit after profit after profit. 50 trades, I'll make 20% of my account balance. And so, maybe 10%, but that's not important as long as we're making money, right? Um, Yeah, you guys need to watch this over the weekend. Like the first day, I was, um, it's the first time I've ever traded it. Like I've had this idea in the back of my mind for a long time, and I've kind of traded it a little bit, but I always got too aggressive and like wanted to make more money faster and was doing stupid stuff. Um, but I never had it perfected like I have it now. And it took me one day trading it, and then one day of revi revising it, and now it's perfected. And I have all the rules written out on an Excel sheet. All you gotta do is understand those rules before you get started. And I live stream with you and I show you how to make the money. Like if you guys are showing up and you guys are actually like engaging in the content and investing your, your own money, then like I'll start live streaming all trading day long. And I'll be there with you the whole time. You can call in and ask questions. You can like, there's no limit people. And so, um, on that Excel sheet, I also have a trading journal of just a few metrics you need to take down every time you make a trade, and it lets you perfectly calculate your profit loss at the end of every day um, just by reviewing the trades that you made, at what price you bought, what price you sold, and I got it all formulated to where all you got to do is punch in the numbers. Um, what else? You guys got to join me. Like... I don't know what's going to happen, so when you join me, we're going to make money, and I don't know how much money they're going to let us make before they just turn off the stock market. I mean, they can turn off the options and not the stocks if they wanted to, but if you turn off the options all across the board, I think a lot of people would sell their stocks and we're going to see the biggest market crash we've ever seen. Um, so it might be a good idea to load up a couple months out to expire super deep out of the money puts that cost almost nothing just throw like a thousand dollars in there and then let's go make the money and I mean hopefully they just let us trade this for the next six months and we all make a billion dollars you can turn a hundred thousand dollars into probably probably thirty million dollars in the next six months doing what I'm doing six hours a day just putting the time better than any job you'll find you need like you got to have a day trading margin account 
option day trading margin account in order to perfect the strategy. And so that does require a $25,000 minimum balance. So if you're gonna do this, I'd recommend starting with a $30,000 balance um, and minimum. And you'll make $1,000 probably a day. If you don't make $1,000 a day, you'll make $2,000 a week minimum every week. $30,000 and you can make 100 grand a year trading minimum. But that, like, that's only if you, that's assuming you take your profits and you spend every dollar. If you reinvest that money, and you keep going for more, so it takes you a week. It takes you maybe one to two weeks to um, double your thirty thousand into sixty thousand. Are you gonna double that sixty thousand into one hundred twenty thousand, or are you gonna go spend that thirty thousand on a car? But either way, you're getting money, you're getting paid. Um, yeah, I mean, you guys just got to get your attention span down. Watch this over the weekend; it'll motivate you to quit your job, man. No matter what the market does, I make money. That's what's happening here. It's guaranteed. This is financial advice. Sue me, bro. If it doesn't work, sue me. I promise. Oh, man. I just did a space call on Twitter, and it was nuts. Like, I don't know how many of you guys that are watching heard the last space call with uh, the Prodigy guy and just how ridiculous they were talking down to me. Well, this one that I did was like half the people liked me half the people didn't like me and the host made me a co-host and like so I turned I made one guy stop speaking one time they asked me not to do that again but it's like I'm co-host and he was talking shit to me calling me an idiot and so yeah it was like we got deep in that conversation they were attacking me for suing Mullen they were t telling me I'm not allowed to talk about Mullen no more and I'm like, says who? <laughs> and then they were, uh, what else they did say? Oh, they like, we got like pretty deep into the part about me being Jesus and what it means that like everyone's gonna kneel at my feet. Whether you love to kneel at my feet and it's joyful for you that like you are finally a free man and I have all the people that hold power over you, I have taken their power and now there's no power over you because I don't give a fuck what you do as long as you're not a bad person. Oh, man. The point is, like, the keys of the government, the, fed the keys of the Federal Reserve is going to be in my hand one day. Take it to the bank. And when it is, I don't let nobody manipulate the numbers no more. I mean, basically, I'm come, I become in control of the numbers and make sure that you guys never get lied, lied or cheated again. Lied to or cheated again. Hmm. And then we talked a little bit about the strategy and all they could say is, I wanna buy more Mullen if I get more money. Rather than make, like take a portion of it aside just in case Mullen takes six months to squeeze and invest with me every single day and get to where you buy five times as much Mullen as you have right now in the next, probably before the October driving thing. I mean, come on, people. What are you waiting for? The rest of the month of September, you got to be doing this with me. I don't know if it's like a subconscious thing or if I've ever thought about it or if it's just the grace of God that I perfectly can articulate this strategy and execute this strategy, live trading with my fingers, that the grace of God that it just fell upon me or like part of me, like if you just think about it, just think about it. Like, the story would have been unfinished had I just, like, done this three years ago. I had to go collect my damages on AMC, collect my damages against my brother with my life insurance thing, collect my damages against Mullen. And when I say my damages, I mean, the, like, what they stole from me as a retail investor. So it's for all retail investors. Like, I've been suffering for the last two years working back-breaking jobs where I cut my hands every single day. And I know more about money than anybody on this goddamn planet. How crazy is that? 
and how to make it, where it comes from, what it does, who's manipulating it, how they manipulate it. Almost every data point that people are tracking right now is 100%. They can make it go anywhere they want, any day they want, and it means absolutely nothing because they don't give us the real data. <laughs> I mean, some of it's probably real because there's no reason to hide it because it's just, it doesn't matter, but whenever they need to hide it, they absolutely do. That's for sure. Oh, man. Well, it's going to be a long weekend. I can't wait till the stock market opens again. I'll be there in the morning, ready to show you guys how to make money. Um, I might make one more video where I go through the actual video right here. And I screenshot a bunch of things. And then I come in and talk about all the screenshots just so you can see the numbers. Um, actually, now that I think about it, we did look at 13 trades at the end of the day. So this was my last positions, and I just closed them all out real quick. And then I come and I fill in the data. Let's see here. Oh. All right, I'll look at it later. But basically, I went over the entire Excel. Um, and I looked at all 13 trades. So we could have looked at them all and seen how much we profited. But I thought, I thought it was at the end of the video, but clearly not. So I will go through and find it, and I'll show it to you guys. But outside of proving the numbers to you and showing you where the stock price was moving at the same time um, to show that, like, no matter how much it moves, we're not in trouble. It's okay. Um, yeah. I mean, we like it, honestly. If it moves enough, a 2% 2 per, 2 swing makes it to where we're making way more money on one side then we lost combined with all of our calls betting it was going to go back the other direction it's a beautiful system it's a perfect system and me showing that on thursday and then joe biden giving that speech like it's probably correlated when joe biden condemned mega republicans it wasn't about trump it wasn't about people thinking trump is great it's all about christianity they want to be government they don't want to be ruled by christ i am your christ and I will rule them. I promise. Joe Biden will kneel at my feet. 